And whatever happens after that, happens, baby. We let life happen. We let life happen for us. It's not happening to us, it's happening for us. And that's my word for the day. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Don't worry about how I look, mind your business. Um, <laughs> I'm just playing. I just decided last minute to finish, to like film the rest of my makeup and just show y'all like today is a day of organization and just getting my life back on track. It's been a lot going on. So I feel like I need to start within my home and within myself. So I just got up super early, got up about 6.30 and just started moving around a little bit. And I was like, you know, let me just go ahead and get my makeup out the way because I don't know exactly what I'm doing today outside of this. I may end up leaving the house a little later, but if I do have to leave, and maybe go somewhere go out eat or anything like that i said i would just already have my makeup done and you know all i have to do is shower and go so i decided to film the rest of my makeup i'm not talking to y'all too much i just wanted to start the vlog off so i'm gonna finish doing this with your eyes on me and um yeah we're just gonna live life I was like, where's my primer this is not a detailed makeup routine, by the way. This is not a detailed makeup tutorial. This is not what that video is for. That video is just not, that's not what I'm doing today. That's not what type of energy I'm on. So I will not be listing products. <laughs> I'm just, I'm not talking through it. I'm just doing it. So enjoy some music and the satisfaction of me doing my makeup, okay? Okay. <laughs>
tedious i'm like yo what the hell i woke up at 6 45 i probably started cleaning about eight because i did my makeup and stuff y'all saw that and baby it's going on two o'clock <laughs> it's going on two o'clock and i'm still cleaning i had so much laundry it's just been a cleaning day but you know what i'm really happy i got up early because if i would have started this later on it would have went into nightfall where i would have just went to bed so I'm about done now. Probably got about another hour to go. I got a couple more loads of laundry to do and then some deep cleaning upstairs. So I'll be doing that. And then I think I'm gonna step out for, for a little vibe today. I'm gonna step out, I'm gonna treat myself because <laughs> I done worked hard all morning. I done worked the whole shift this morning. Still looking like this, still in my little, you know what I'm saying? So I'm about to get into it. I just thought I'd hop on here and provide y'all with an update. Crib. I can never tell a shit it is what it is. But said what I had to and did what I did. Never turn my back on every cheek, God forbid. Heard you got a paddock on my wrist, doing front flips. Giving you my number, but don't hit me on no gun shit. Working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. I just did like a quick outfit clip because we were rushing out the house, but I think we're about to just go get some food and some massages and um just really chill out. I deserve it. <laughs> no, I've been up all morning. I'm mother looking tired, okay? So I just feel like I deserve it. So we're gonna head out there. I'm just, we had to make a pit stop and then we're on the way. So I don't know exactly where we're getting food from, but. Past us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Good morning. 
It is Monday. I just needed to come to Target real quick to get some stuff for the house and then for myself. That I just been I've been really lazy. I should have been coming to Target like two, three days ago, but I just been like pushing through. But decided to get up this morning and come get my items. I probably grab me like a small breakfast so I could take my vitamins when I get back home. But yeah, it's like nine o'clock in the morning. It's like nine thirty, I think. Yeah. So I'm about to go in here, run and get my items. And then, honestly, I don't know what I'm doing today, but I think, for one, I needed to get this stuff for sure. And then I was going to go back home and straighten up a little bit and then figure out what the moves are so I can get dressed. Or, I don't know, we're kind of going with the flow. Yeah, I have a lot on my mind. Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. Say my day the number, but I keep waking up. Oh, you see my text, baby, please say something Flying by the flash, man, I'm cheap, skate, huh? Niggas gotta move on my release day, huh? Bitch, this is fame, not clock I don't even know what that's about, watch your mouth Baby, got an ego twice the size of the crib I can never tell a shit, it is what it is but Said what I had to and did what I did Never turn my back on every G, God forbid on my wrist, doing front flips, giving you my number, but don't hit me on no dumb shit. Working on the weekend like usual, way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my time. Hey girl, so I just decided to come to um Home Goods because I want to buy some flowers today. But I need a new vase. I don't like any of the vases I have, and I want more of like a modern looking vase. So I decided to come to Home Goods. Target, I got everything I needed. But child, when Target is remodeling or restocking, it's just like one of the messiest places. I don't, it gets on my nerves. But they did have everything that I needed. It was just some other items that I could have used that would have been nice to have. But they, it's okay. So I'm at Home Goods. I'm about to go in here and see if they have have a cute little modern looking vase for my countertop and then i'm gonna go buy some pretty flowers and put those out it's just like i'm treating myself a little bit you know because i can do that i can i can treat myself because i can yeah so i'm gonna do that and then we'll probably just grab something for breakfast or i might just go home and make like some turkey bacon or something <sighs> i'm i'm barely making it out here i'm so tired Oh. So yeah, let's go in here and see what they got. Hopefully something. And then I'll show y'all what I what I get when I get back to the to the house. Is, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once. Okay, so what? Someone hit the block up. I tell you if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood. This shit too plush. Say my day the number, but I keep waking up. Oh, you see my text, baby, please say something Flying by the flash, man, I keep skating home Niggas gotta move on my release day, huh? Bitch, this is fame, not clock I don't even know what that's about, watch your mouth Baby, got an ego twice the size of the crib I can never tell a shit, it is what it is but Said what I had to and did what I did Never turn my back on every G, God forbid I do a quick target haul. I actually been back home for about 30, maybe 40 minutes now. I literally sat in my car the whole time. It's the worst habit I have. But we can just do a quick little target haul. I kind of showed y'all what I got. Um, and I'll tell y'all how much I spent in Target today. I got me a new bath scrub because my other one i like change i like to change these out probably like every month or so i probably should do it more often than that but every month or so works for me right now so i got me a new bath scrub got me some sensodyne this is the only toothpaste i use i got some crack for my <laughs> i got some crack for my shower because my drainage system well, my, my showers and stuff can tend to get, like, backed up. And you just put a little bit of this down there and let it sit for, like, 15, 20 minutes. Run some water after it. It's back to new. 
I got me a new sponge. This is the charcoal one by Echo Tools. Um, I just needed a new one. I got one in there. I just want to, I wanted to refresh all my items. So I got a new sponge. I'm actually trying this for the first time. This is a moisturizing shave oil um, by Tree Hut. I always use the Tree Hut um, whipped butter and the Tree Hut scrub, which I'm about to show y'all. But I was like, let me just try something else. Cause I've been thinking about like new shaving creams and stuff to use instead of just like my body wash. So I'm gonna try this. If you've already tried it, let me know what it's giving. Um, this is my go-to body wash right now. Method Body, the hydrating body wash. The green one, this is the only one I use. It smells so good. It's just, baby. It's just giving what it should give, okay. I got some new laundry detergent. Definitely need this. And I got, I get a separate detergent for my brushes. I wash my brushes and my sponges with Dawn soap as well. So I just get a separate one. I'm got me some makeup wipes up and up. Deodorant. This is the sugar scrub I use, the Tree Hut Exotic Bloom Sugar Scrub. This is the only one I've been using. A lot of them smell good, but I've just been stuck on this one for a minute now. So, and then I bought me another bottle of Dr. Till's Sleep Bath. I use this every time I take a bath. Um, I'll probably take a bath like once a week, once a week, sometimes once every two weeks. It just depends on what's going on in life, how busy I am. But when I have my very, my deep self care days and I want to take a bath. I put this in there and to me y'all it doesn't make me sleepy but when i finally do go to sleep for that night i go into like the deepest sleep i i sleep so good so and then i just bought this flower vase from Publix. i'm gonna take the flowers out of here it's cool a little neutral color but i just like the flowers in it i'm gonna take it out of here and put it in here and yeah we're gonna get into it so he on no gun shit, working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. It's the next day. I could not get myself together yesterday. I was just, I was all over the place. I was all over the place. I did go get some things done, but it was like a little, the I, the things I was, what I was doing was super important, so I couldn't really film. So I kind of just like stayed out the way, but it's a new day. Um, I got some new hair in. I got, y'all can see my trash can. Mind your damn business. Um, I got new hair in and I got my nails done, so I'm not colorful anymore. Um, that's something I did yesterday that I did not show you guys. I meant to, but whew, the attitude I had in that nail salon, baby, it was not worth it. So, yeah, I sat quiet, minding my business. Um, today, I'm getting ready to... It's actually later in the day. I'm getting ready to go see Kevin Hart. He's in Atlanta. Um, I haven't seen him in person at all, like, ever. No stand-up, no nothing. So, this will be a first time. I'm kind of excited. I want to see how funny he is in person. I'm sure he is hilarious. I actually really love Kevin Hart. So I think it's going to be a good night. I think I got some good seats. It's going to be a vibe. So we're going to get into that. I'm going to get into an outfit um, check. And then um, I got to handle something before I go. I got to send a couple of emails before I go. And then I think that's it. It's always sirens out here. They're just disrespectful as hell. Anyways... I got to send some emails before I go, but after that, free game. I'm going to probably head out within the next 45 minutes to an hour, i say. So, let's do an outfit check. I have on this leather set. I actually got this from Fashion Nova. I really got this for fall, but I was like, you know what? This is kind of cute. This is kind of cute. We're going to wear this today. So, it's like this, like that. It's actually really, really cute, y'all. I haven't decided if I'm going to wear heels. I'm, I'm leaning towards heels, but I want to be comfortable. So I haven't decided if I was going to wear heels or sneakers. Either way, like if I wear sneakers, you're literally not going to see them. They're going to be covered like this. If I wear heels, you'll kind of see them a little bit, you know, a little shabby. But I don't know. We'll see. But this is the outfit check. I'll be carrying my black YSL bag, all black leather, black hair, black fit, black shoes, <laughs> all black everything. You know? 
Okay, y'all, so we went to this event. It was so fun. I could not film anything because as soon as you walk through the door, y'all, like as soon as you walk through the little, you know, you got to go through the security scanner or whatever. As soon as you walk through that, they literally take your phone, put it inside this lock bag, give you the bag and say they're not going to open it until you come out. So they make you put your phone in there, turn it off or turn it on silent and they keep it locked. Like you literally could not open it until you were getting ready to walk out the door. <laughs> and I get it. It's a stand up comedy. You don't want people like filming your show and posting it before you even get to their city. So I could not film anything. I wish I could have one. When I tell y'all this was the funnest <laughs> most hilarious event I've been to. Oh my goodness, it was so good. And if you get a chance to go before he ends the tour, you should, it was so lit. So that's why I don't have any footage here. I just thought I'd come on here and say that. <laughs> I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT. Two turn baby girl, you know me. Still with the dolls that I grew beside. All the niggas round me. I just don't understand why the camera zooms in so much when I hit record, but anyways, whatever. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I am currently, I just finished up my hair and my makeup. I'm going to film a fall try on haul today, so I kind of want to get it out of the way early. It's not early, early. It's 1030 right now. I usually like to get this stuff over with by like 9, 9.30, but whatever. I'm going to get the video over with, and then I think I'm going to just go take some Instagram pictures, and then I'm going to take myself out to eat today. Um, I don't really know where, but I'm craving like a strawberry flavored mimosa or something. I don't know. I don't know, but I'm craving something, so I'm probably going to go somewhere today. It's very gloomy out, so I don't know what the fit is going to look like. I feel like I just want to dress comfortable, but I don't want to be too, like, too dressed down because I don't know where I'm going to go eat at. And if I go to a place that's, like, super dressy and I look like the only one in there with sweats or something on, then I'm going to feel stupid. So, I don't know. I'm about to, um, I was just watching some Transformation Church. I really want to find a church to get into, y'all. I've been missing church. I really want to, I've been, like, finding myself just, like, wanting to go to church when I wake up. And I don't, it's hard in Atlanta. It's just hard because you don't really know. Like, I know of a decent church, but it's, like, one of those huge, huge churches. And sometimes I feel like those, I don't know, I feel like it's not genuine sometimes because of, you know... They, they be wanting money or this, that, and the third. So I be, I be having a hard time trusting. <sighs> I have a hard time trusting, but whatever. I don't want to get into church. But until then, I'm just going to keep watching my sermons on YouTube and my, my business. The only thing I've left to do with my makeup is my lips. I have to finish. I lined them, but I need to put on some, um, some gloss. And probably I might do a lipstick and then a gloss on top. I don't know. Still nude, though. Um, so, yeah, I have to do that. And then, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and, and get started. I think I want, I'm not going to eat breakfast. I'll probably just have me like a smoothie, a super small smoothie or something, just to put something on my stomach um, because obviously I want to go out to eat. And, yeah. So I'm going to go upstairs, get ready to film this video, put on some clothes and head out, really. That's what we're doing today. And whatever happens after that, happens, baby. We letting life happen. We let life happen for us. It's not happening to us, it's happening for us. And that's my word for the day. Okay, y'all, I'm finna head out. I just wanted to do an outfit check for today. So I have on this really snug hot pink crop from Zara. Um, some shorts from, I have no idea where these are from. Um, I just put on my Gucci sneakers today, and then I put on gold jewelry to complement the whole fit, and I just grabbed my YSL clutch for today because it's just, it only makes sense. Oh, and I wear my, I haven't worn this in so long, 
but I'm wearing my really cute, really chill. I'm obsessed with these earrings. I got these from um, Zara. You know, these earrings are so cute, but they just, I just think Zara is overcharging. I feel like you can find these kind of earrings like online, wholesale or something. And Zara is charging $22 per pair in there. So I'm going to look online and see if I can find some other ones. Because I like, I really like the style of them. I like how thick they are. I like how gold they are. But I really feel like they're overpriced, to be honest. Whatever. So yeah, this is the fit for today. I'm finna head out. I think I'm going to vlog on my camera. I mean, on my phone today because I'm not carrying a big bag and I like to kind of keep my bag, my camera in my purse at times and I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm going to have to hold it in my hand all day and I don't think I want to do that. So yeah, I think I'll vlog on my phone and hopefully the quality is still, de bleh, still decent. So I'll check in with you in a second. Love you. Okay, girl. <laughs> this is so lazy of me. So I'm back home. I ended up just um I wanted to go somewhere to like vibe out and smoke hookah and stuff, but I didn't feel like dealing with the rain. It was kind of raining when I was on my way. So I was like, I need to find a restaurant where I can just like you know, be closer to the door, be able to walk in and not have to deal with parking too much. Cause usually if I go somewhere, I'm having like park on a parking deck and then walk into the location. So I was like, I need to find a place that's like closer or that's more convenient. So I ended up going to Toast on Linux. If you're from Atlanta or you live in Atlanta, you know exactly what that is. And if not, it's just this really popular, if you don't know, it's this really popular brunch spot. I knew I wouldn't have any trouble getting in. It's usually super packed and you got to wait forever. But I knew I didn't have any. I wasn't going to have any trouble getting in because it's literally only me. And yeah. So I went there. I took a seat at the bar. I had um, chicken and French toast instead of chicken and waffles. I like French toast more than waffles. Mind your business. And I got me a couple of mimosas. I got a mango mimosa. Then I got a strawberry one. I didn't take a picture of the strawberry one, unfortunately. But it actually looked better than, than the mango one. Um, so yeah, I got a couple of Moses and then I left there. Linux was literally right down the street, it is down right down the street from Toast on Linux. So I ended up stopping at the mall for a bit. And then I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and get back to my side of town because I knew traffic was about to be crazy near where I live. Um, traffic was insane when I was leaving because, because the game, um, the Falcons were playing the Saints today. So it's like, let me just go ahead and start inching my way back so I don't be, you know, so caught up in this mess. And I wanted to beat the storm. It's actually about to start storming out. It was kind of like drizzling earlier, but it's going to be, it's supposed to be storming in a bit. So I was like, let me just get back. So yeah, now I'm back home. I came straight and got in my bed. <laughs> this lazy as hell. I came straight upstairs and got in my bed 
<laughs> to like, I'm gonna get some rest for a bit because I want to take some Instagram pictures. But the way I feel right now, I'm too tired and kind of like, I'm kind of like, um, what you call it? Not lit lit, but I'm kind of like tipsy from the mimosas. So I was like, let me just, let me rest a little bit. So I might just lay here for a while, probably for about an hour or two and turn on Love Island. I just started Love Island USA. I'm still on the first episode. I was count I was trying to catch up with Love Island UK. It was so good and I just finished out one yesterday so I started on USA today. So yeah, that's what I'm on. I just wanted to check in and not leave y'all hanging like I normally would. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all in a bit. Okay, hey girl. So, I'm I'm back refreshed. I'm rested. I feel good. I just wanted to check in. So I'm actually about to go back outside. <laughs> Sunday fun day. We having a ball all day. So I'm going back outside. I'm going to meet up with my friends. So have some drinks, smoke some hookah, vibe out. And just have a good time. So I'll see y'all in a bit. This does they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes. I'm too turned up. Virgil got a panic on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once. Okay, so what? I have to do my facial routine. You know, moisturize and all that good stuff. But I thought I'd come on here and like kind of just close out the day.